everyone and welcome back to my channel. Baby Metal recently supported Bring Me The Horizon at Next Fest in Japan, along with other bands that were supporting them, but Baby Metal was obviously a highlight for me and we just, everyone knew that they have to come on on Bring Me The Horizon set and do Kingslayer, which was released at the end of 2020 and it was such a blessing. It Honestly, it's one, I think, this is, I don't know, but I think it's in my like, top 10 baby metal songs because I love it so much. It is just so like, it's so powerful. And I just love all the vocals from Ollie. And we were waiting so desperately to see what choreography they would do. And just to hear Sue's vocals and Moa's vocals, which is probably only her on the recording, but Momoko's and Moa's vocals together. I've just been dying to know what the dance will be like I I had like a thing in my head of what it could be like but honestly I've seen I will admit I've seen some fan cams of the some of the performances that they've done so it's, this isn't a complete surprise to me but seeing the pro shot of this is just going to blow my mind like close-ups of the girls and Ollie and just the band the whole like stage setup what it looked like from different angles and everything so they have now released a live music video version of this song of them playing together so i'm just gonna watch it probably scream cry and or throw up who knows because king said it's really really hits deep i got my king slay hoodie on uh, for the occasion so let's just do it Right, so it's it's five minutes long, so they're, they're obviously going to show Itch for the Cure as well at the start, which is so good. Like, I barely listened to that. I wish it was connected to the actual song, because like, I want to be a Kingslayer, which is so cool. So here we go. Oh, my shot of Ollie running through the crowd. Featuring Baby Metal. Oh, the stage, honestly. This is amazing. Oh my god, imagine the feeling of being there and just seeing this intro, knowing that they might all gonna come on stage. Project Kingslayer. Ah! Oh, the girls are coming on, the girls are coming on. Oh my god, they're the biggest ch They're like, yeah, we're here. We're finally performing it. Oh, they're there, they're really... Sue's giving it! <laughs> the camera shots on this are too, too good. Oh my gosh! The dance is so good. Such a slay. Here we go. I just want to ascend. I love this move. As Finn would say, heavy metal dolls. Perfection. I just love it so much. Oh, she sounds like an angel. Choreography is so good. Yes, Moa! Get it! Oh, I 
love it when they do the head bang. Yes! <clears throat> yes, I'm speechless too. That was incredible. I don't think I would ever have headbang, mosh, dance, sung as hard as any other song I've seen this one. They're so lucky, Japan is so lucky that they saw them together perform this song because we, we thought that it would never happen. And I thought when they toured the UK in 2021, I think, or end, end of 2021, well, I knew, I knew they were meant to be supporting them, but they weren't performing around that time. But, so that was like taken away. Like I bought tickets to see them with some of other friends as well, but I sold my tickets just because they, they weren't going to support them. They were not around. But we finally got it. The dance is so good. I'm just so glad that I can actually visualise it with the dances now because I enjoy the song so much more when I know what the dances are. That's so weird, I don't know. But I just love watching them dancing. It's just, it's just, um, I love it. Thank you to Koba for letting them perform with Bermuda Horizon in their own country. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye. We need a Momoko Funko Pop.